where knowledge is king and lady luck is queen. It's the Joker's Wild. And now, here's the host of our show, Jack Barry. Thank you very much for welcome once again to the Joker's Wild. On our last program, he found a brand new champion. He won a game and then got into his second game, which we didn't get a chance to finish. So, Jay Stewart, would you reintroduce the players and tell us their scores? My pleasure, Jack. Here's our current champion, an educational counselor and a basketball coach. It's Max Fraley. And his opponent is a ladies' specialty designer originally from New York City. This is Gene Desmond. Gene and Max, pleased to have you back. I asked Jay to give you the scores, but actually he didn't, didn't quite know what they were at the moment. I know they're $300 to 450 You're trailing at the moment, Gene. And on the last program, Max, we learned that you have five children, only one of whom was in the audience. Same youngster back? That's right, Jack. Isn't that nice? My son, Patrick. And Gene, you, uh, you were originally from New York, and you, as we understand, designed brassiers. Right. That's right. Uh-huh. And you have $300, you're trailing in this game, and I, hope, and I know you're hoping you'll get ahead so this game won't be a big bust, right? <laughs> all night thinking that went up <laughs> <laughs> oh it was really nothing <clears throat> max with this with you're in the lead right now i know you're hoping to continue in that lead let me show you the categories we were using and which we'll continue to use they are fast forward numbers followed by spelling bee then we have roaring 20s nursery rhymes and abraham lincoln all right with the score 300 to 450 it's your spin gene desmond spin them around you have a joker, Abraham Lincoln, and the spelling bee. I'll take the spelling bee for 100. Correct answer. It'll bring you to $400. A lot of embarrassing things can happen on nationwide television. You can avoid that by spelling the word embarrassing. E-M-B-A-R-R-A-S-S-I-N-G. -S you now have $400. Very well done. <laughs> Max, your spin. Roaring 20s, spelling bee, and a pair. I'll take Roaring 20s for 50, Jack. Correct answer would bring you to $500, and you would win your second game. The Roaring 20s were christened the Jazz Age by the author of The Great Gatsby. For $500 in this game, plus the $500 in the previous game, you'll be winning a total of $1,000 in cash if you can give me the last name of the writer. Fitzgerald. You're right, for $1,000. Congratulations, Max. Winning yourself $1,000, and in a moment you'll get a chance to come over here and spin against the devil. Well, Jean, I'm sorry we have to say goodbye to you because you're certainly a lovely lady. Thank Backstage you. will be some consolation prizes. Let's say goodbye now to Jean Desmond, and we'll be back spinning against the devil after this. Turn five Pacific. We uh, will proceed with our match against the devil in just a moment. Before we do, may I remind you that any player who wins five games in a row gets a special bonus gift. It's a brand new car! The Buick Skylark with high energy ignition and powered by the economical even firing V6 engine for efficient and optimum fuel economy. It's the Buick Skylark! Last time, Max Fraley came over here, he ran smack into a devil. He's going to try to avoid that this time. Max, come on over and do it. Hey, Jack. Nice to be back here again. It's huh? great to be back here again. Up on the windows again, we have nothing but money and devils. Every time you spin and avoid the devil, you'll get the money. You can get to $1,000 without seeing that devil. You didn't do it last time. Maybe this time you will. You'll get the money, and look at these windows for the gifts. Max, this time it's the Joker's Wild Gifts for the Den and Study Package. First, for your correspondence convenience, it's an electric typewriter. The Brother Cassette Electric Typewriter, 13-inch carriage, easy load cassette ribbon system, corrections without changing the ribbon, furnished by Brother. Next, quench your thirst with this beer dispenser. Enjoy the fresh goodness of draft beer anytime from a Marvel draft beer dispenser. Marvel, a product of Dayton Walter Corporation. And for the entire family, it's a learning library. World Books 22 volume encyclopedia, including research guide and index volume. It's easy to use, easy to read, and easy to understand. Plus Childcraft, the 15 volume how and why library. Next, to warm up this package, it's a fireplace. Three ways energy miser built-in fireplace. The energy-saving fireplace that uses outside air for combustion. 
the Energy Miser, furnished by Freeway. And finally, Max, you can watch the Joker's Wild and other favorite shows on this beautiful Philco 25-inch color TV. <laughs> Quality and beauty in Mediterranean styling, genuine pecan veneers and hardwood solids, featuring Philco Color Right Automatic Picture Control System. And Max, this gift package is worth, in cash and prizes, over $3,600. Got to stay away from that devil. He's a devil opponent, Jack. But I think we can beat him. First spin gets you 25, 75, 150. He's running with 250. Out in the audience is a youngster and your wife. She says go. And the little boy says so, too. How old is he? That's 11. He's 11, and he gets you 25, 50, and 25. 350, 350. Let's go, let's go. Okay. Let's get 350. 50, 50, 25. Going up to 75. Getting hot, getting hot. Oh, well, your wife's saying go. She doesn't care how she spends her money. 125, 50. Now the decision gets tough. $650. Got to go, Jack. Got to go, Jack. They're with you. They're with you. 100, 100. Oh, you're good. Oh, let's go. Yeah. <laughs> well, very happy to see that young man out there. Here's the money. 100, 200, 300, 400, 500, 600, 700, 800, 900, 1,000, 1,050. Plus the money and the gifts and the prizes. You are winning now, at the end of your second game, a grand total of $4,650. Yeah, that is great. <laughs> that is super. Game number three comes on up now. Go on over and face your next one. All right, thank you. Nice hand for Max Fraley. <laughs> Max Fraley has won two games. He'd like to make it number three. He'll have to beat this lady. Jay? Our next player is a shop owner from Oakland, California, Jack. She sells real estate and loves to travel. Meet Jackie Wilson. Hi, Jackie. Hi, Jack. You know, a few mo I noticed that you have a shop in Oakland. That's right. A few moments ago, we had Jean Desmond on, who designs brassiers. I wonder if you carry her line. <laughs> no, we don't. <laughs> we do carry beautiful arts and crafts from all over the world. Oh, it's arts and crafts. That's right. Uh -huh. No brassiers. Not as yet. <laughs> After meeting her, I may add her line. It's, she seems like a very wonderful designer. Well, I'm sure she is. And uh, if you add her line, I'm sure you'll make her happy because she didn't win too, too much on the program. Whether you'll win or not depends on how you do with these categories. Here they are. Categories are who's Watson wears, followed by gentlemen in song, multiple meanings, nicknames of cities, and the American Revolution. Challenge goes first. Jackie Wilson, your spin. Who, what, where, the pair, and multiple meanings. Well, let's try who, what, where's for 200. Okay, in the film International Velvet, Tatum O'Neill plays a young girl who follows in her aunt's footsteps and becomes a horsewoman. In the original film, National Velvet, who played the role of Velvet? Elizabeth Taylor. Right, for $100. <laughs> your spin match in your third game. Joker, nicknames, and a triple. Gotta go, nicknames for cities for 200. It's not the most glamorous nickname in the world, but what New England, but what New England city has as its nickname the city of baked beans? Boston. Right, you have 200 hours. Your spin, Jackie. American Revolution, gentlemen in song, nicknames of cities. Let's try nicknames of cities for 50. One large southwestern city is nicknamed the Big D. Name that city. Denver? Nope. $50 if you can tell me. Max? Dallas. Big D from Dallas. Right, you're up to $50. And your spin. Multiple meetings, Joker, and a triple. Well, I'll have to go multiple meetings for $200. For $450 in total. What one word describes both a batting order in baseball and a crowd of crooks at a police station? Batting order in 
$4.50. Line up. Right. You have $4.50. Score $104.50. Your spin. Jackie. Yeah. All American Revolution, Joker, and nicknames of cities. Let's try the American Revolution for 100 What was the official name of the group which adopted the Declaration of Independence on July 4th, 1776? The Continental Congress? Correct. Second Continental Congress. You have $200. Your spin. Max. Multiple meeting. Joker and a triple. Jack, I'm going to go off the board for Gentleman in Song. For 50 $50. Correct answer. Brings you your third win. Brings you $500. Brings your total winnings up to $5,150. For that amount, one song by the rock group The Who tells the story of a kid who defeats the pinball wizard. For $5,150, name the kid. Tommy. Yes! dark recesses of your brain. You're winning $5,150 or more. You'll get a chance again to face that devil. As for you, Jackie, you had a short stay on the program, but I'm sure everybody listening will go down to your arts and craft shop in well, Oakland, California you. and buy some nice things. You'll have some nice consolation prizes. <laughs> Goodbye, Jackie. We'll be back spinning again against the devil after this. I'd like to give you this pretty Easter. And Max Fairley, come on over here and face that devil once again. Thanks, Jack. That was a quickie. Yes, it was. <laughs> Up on the wheels this time, you can avoid that devil. And if you can get to $1,000, take a look here and see what prizes you'd win. Max, for you, it's another Joker's Wild Home and Travel Package. First for meals in minutes, it's a microwave. A three-level variable power microwave from Hardwick with digital clock, touch panel control, temperature sensing probe. Cook by time or temperature with Hardwick. Next to put on that range is American Electric's kitchen appliances, including the work-saving American food processor. It cuts, shreds, chops, pears, slices, blends, grinds, and grates. It can turn a cook into a chef, furnished by American Electric Company. And for easy cleanup, it's a dishwasher. Portable and convertible with cutting board top features 11 automatic cycles, including pot scrubbing cycle and energy efficient air dry cycle. Also has soft scrap disposer, dispenser for detergent and rinse additives from Kelvinator. And next you'll entertain in elegance with this crystal. Leonard Silver's genuine hand cut full lead crystal. Featuring a vase, decanters, bowls and many other sparkling crystal accessories for your home. All furnished by the Leonard Silver Manufacturing Company. Then for your home or travels, put your fun on film with this compact chin on 35 millimeter camera. With fast chin-on lens, it's all you ever need for perfect pictures every time. Chin-on, we make it easy for you. And finally, Max, it's time to travel, so load up that camera because we're flying you to romantic Rome. The capital city of Italy. Enjoy Rome's gentle lifestyle. Sightsee among the ancient ruins. Lie in the sun. Dine on gourmet cuisine and look at the world's greatest art in a place where men have been able to divide and conquer time. Furnished by Club Universe. And Max, this home and travel package is worth in cash and prizes over $3,650. Way to get the Rome is to avoid the devil. Give him a spin. All right, beware the Ides of March, I guess. We first spin, you get 200, 100, Ooh, 325, 100, 200, 300, 325. Oh, your wife wants to go to Rome. She's got that Italian spirit, I think. Yeah, right. You have 50, 100, 100. And the top four, the five, and the five, seven, five. You're that boy of yours. Gotta go, gotta go. Just be five, seven, five. <laughs> 75. Oh. <laughs> well, you can't win them all. As no, they say. you can't. That's Point right. a trite expression. <laughs> However, you're still winning over five thousand dollars, and of course, you get a chance to win that trip. You can win another game. So go on back and meet your next opponent, right. Max Fraley, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> and to oppose him in this game, here is his next challenge. Jack, we're all set now with the secretary. She likes to swim and play racquetball. Meet Gail Jonasson. Hi, Gail. Hi, Jack. How are you? Tell us a little bit about your family. Are you a married lady? Yes, I am. My husband's a glazing contractor, and I have three nice sons. 
Very good. Well, he has three nice sons against five, five sons, is it, Max? No, three daughters and two sons. Three daughters and two sons. Well, it's three youngsters against five youngsters and a mother against a dad, and here are the categories you'll be using. They are colleges, followed by Academy Awards. Then we have first lines, insects, and finally, Africa. Gail Jonasson, your spin. Good luck. Thank you, Jack. And you get colleges, Joker, and Academy Awards. I'll take Academy Awards, Jack, for 100. Richard Duval, Al Pacino, and James Caan were all Oscar nominees in 1973 for The Godfather. But the prize was won by a musical performer for his role in Cabaret. Name him. Joel Gray. You have $100. Very good. <laughs> Max Raley, in your fourth game, good luck. Joker, Africa, and a triple. Uh, I'll take Africa for 200, Jack. This German physician and philosopher established a jungle hospital in what is now Gabon. Name this 1952 Nobel Prize winner. Oh, um. Uh -oh. Schweitzer. On the bell? Too late, too late. Too late. Too late? Well, they ruled you too late on that, and so what I'm going to have to do is destroy that question and give you another question. You're entitled to hear one, uh, Gail. So I'm going to have to give you another question on Africa. If you can answer it, you will pick up the $200, which he just did not get. Okay, here is that question. This African waterfall, which is located between Rhodesia and Zambia, was named after one of England's most beloved monarchs. For $200, name the falls. Victoria. Right, you have $300. <laughs> Score 300 to zero, and it's your spin, Gail. And you get a joker, a joker, and a joker. You know what you do now, pick a, pick a category, answer a question, you win the game. Um, Academy Awards. Okay, one correct answer. Brings you to $500 and brings you a championship. If you miss it, the game goes on as before. Jason Robards won the Academy Award as the Best Supporting Actor of 1977. For $500, for which film did Robards win the award? Oh. Long Day's Journey into Night. No, I'm sorry. Julia. Julia. So the score stands three out of the zero, and it's your spin, Max. And you get colleges, Africa, and a joker. Uh, I'll take colleges for 100, Jack. Okay. This southwestern state, I saw a funny look in your eye, Max, though as you expected to answer her question. That normally does happen, except in the case when someone is playing, has, has re received three jokers. Right. You don't get the opportunity, but you do get your own question. Okay? Here it is. This southwestern state has several institutions of higher learning, including Rice, Baylor, and Southern Methodist. For $100, name the state. Texas. Right. You have $100. Score 300 to 100, and we'll pick this game up after these words. Celebrity Family View now. Ladies and gentlemen, an important announcement once again. In just about five weeks, we're going to have this year's championship here on the Joker's Wild. The eight eligible top money winners of last year will compete against each other who, to meet our reigning champion, who, as you recall, is Frank Dillon. Now, this will be an all-out battle for this year's championship. And hear this. The winner of this year's Joker's Wild annual tournament will receive, in cash and prizes, $100,000. That'll include some fabulous prizes, too. What's one of them, Jay? It's a brand new Buick! The Skyhawk! The compact, even-firing V6 engine for smooth economical power, overall sporty styling and comfort. It's the Skyhawk! There are also going to be four season trips, four separate trips, each one of them an exhilarating experience of a lifetime. So be sure to be with us. In the winter, it'll be a skiing vacation in Switzerland, in the spring, where else but lovely Paris. In the summer, a three-week unforgettable tour of the South Pacific. And Jay, where to in the fall? Our tournament champion will vacation in the fall in magnificent Morocco. <laughs> Located on the north.
west coast of Africa. Morocco is Africa's closest neighbor to Europe. Its geographical location blends the culture of the old world with its contemporary new world. Our champion will enjoy sun, sports, and spectacular scenery for 15 fabulous fall days in Morocco. Furnished by Club Universe, compliments of the Joker's Wild. And this is all part of our tournament prize totaling in cash and prizes $100,000. And the tournament will start in just about five weeks from now, so put it on your calendar. Be with us. Well, players, uh, we haven't got time to finish this game, but the score is 300 to 100. Gail, you'll be back to the next program? You bet I will. And how about you, Max? No doubt about it. Okay, you'll both get a chance to recuperate a little bit. We'll be using the same categories, of course, as we always do. And we, of course, will hope to see all of you out there. Until next time, then, this is Jack Barry. For all of us in the Joker's Wild, thanks for watching, and see you next time. Bye-bye. Lover's Lounge has great relationships and family feud. Mr. Roper needs to compete. Mr. Howell needs to taunt. Come on. And some stars need to take a deep breath. I'm going to pass out it. The feuding in Hollywood just got a lot more interesting. So let the finger pointing begin as your favorite stars don their battle attire for Celebrity Family Feud. And it's Richard's job to make sure everyone plays nice. Excuse me. Oh. <laughs> Watch Celebrity Family Feud weeknights at 10 Eastern, 7 Pacific, only on Game Show Network.